Hey guys, it's Lisa from the blog farmhouseonboon.com and today I am here in the front entryway of our farmhouse and I want to show you how I got it all ready for spring. So what we have here in the entryway of our farmhouse isn't exactly an entryway at all. We actually, when you walk into our front door, have a dining room on one side and a living room on the other. So it's just one big room. And to the left of the door, there's just a little area behind me between the door and the window. So I've made it an entryway by just adding a few things to kind of make do with what we have because I love seeing, you know, pretty entryways with hooks and a mirror and a bench. And although I can't fit, you know, like a pew or something like that, I can fit something. So I'm going to show you how I created an entryway in a very small space. So the first thing I did was I brought in a mirror, which I had found at a local thrift shop for, I think, less than $20 and I hung that just kind of centered at about eye level so that whenever a, you know average size adult walks by, you can see a reflection in that. Below that, I hung three black hooks. So for that, in the winter, I like to hang a wreath. I hung a greenery wreath for around Christmas time and then the rest of winter. I also brought in a bench, which I found at a thrift shop as well. I think it was probably less than $15, but I don't remember exactly and I topped it with a crochet table topper, which I also found at the thrift store for only a couple dollars. I talked about it in my how to find farmhouse decor at the thrift shop video, which I didn't at the time know what I was gonna do with it, but it's lived on this chair for quite a while, and I really like it here. I think it adds a lot of nice texture, and it's really pretty. I also occasionally like to put um, something seasonal in uh, a crock next to it, so for right now, I'm adding tulips because it is springtime, and tulips are on sale, they're a good deal. I also brought in a few pillows. I have a white pillow that I just always keep around and um, usually keep it on this entryway bench. I also have this pillow that I made from Ikea tea towels. I actually showed a video tutorial right here on YouTube on how to make that. It's really simple. Basically, you just take a Ikea tea towel, fold it in half, sew all the way around, leave one end open, and then add ties. So if you wanna check that tutorial out, I will link it below, but it's a simple project for you, even if you're a very beginner sewer. And I like to move those kind of around our house on occasion. I have them right here. I have them in other places too. I like to swap decor out in different areas just to kind of refresh the space. So for right now, it's gonna be here, completing our springtime farmhouse entryway. I will link all the tutorials and sources for the things found in my small entryway here, as well as the paint color, because I get asked that all the time. Um, obviously, this gray paint color, and then there's a white one to, the, to, the, to my left. For links and sources to everything in our home, go to farmhouseonboon.com and click in the main navigation, Our Farmhouse. That should answer all the questions about everything found in the rest of the house as well. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please hit that subscribe button if you're new. I make two new videos every week on food from scratch, natural living, and our handmade home. Thank you so much for stopping by the farmhouse. Mm -hmm.